been an hour. Yeah, it's been yeah, hour. roughly. I've been roughly. here an hour. Are you serious? Yeah. Really? So where is this or now? Daniel, you're gonna finish what book and we're gonna stay here for night? I'm on seventy seven. But you asked me a question, would you kill if God told you to kill? Yeah, yeah. You asked me a question. but no, before that, why Moses was ordered to kill a woman that slept with a man and keep the young girls? How are they going to play football between each other? No, 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 they, they, that wasn't, you, so you're, you're going to say rape. I'm not going to say, I'm going to answer for you. But that's, I, not I, that's, that's not answer. rape. That's not rape. Right? But why? That's, that's got to do with purity and not rape. Which purity? Of a woman? Yeah. What about the boys? Why is it kill all the boys? Because they're not pure. Even the young boys, five years old boy, he's not we, pure. We don't know what happened to them. We don't know what happened. But the young girls they are pure. You know what they pure mean? Mm. They vagina is pure. Yeah, no, they pure. Yeah. Ah, uh, so it was because of the vagina. No, but that's not that's not rape though. That's got nothing to do with rape. No, no, no. Because because no, because, because, no, 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 no. Because no, wait, so, Danny, you sorry. You I'm not saying rape. rape first of all. I never made that clear. I'm saying. Yeah, but you are implying. No, no. I'm, are you <laughs> implying it? No, I'm not implying rape. No, I'm not implying. implying but I'll imply this oppression in Islam. Sorry. In Islam, there's oppression. You kill a woman has nothing to do with it. What do you mean? In Islam, Allah subhanahu wa taala mentioned the Quran that you don't kill a woman. Prophet said, "Clean hadith." He said, "Don't kill a woman. Don't kill babies. Don't kill children. Don't kill a man that in his temple, Christian or Jew." Okay. Prophet mentioned that clearly in hadith from Bukhari and Muslim. There's many ahadith. In, in what instance? In a war, like in a one to one. You're not allowed to do it. Let alone in a peaceful land. Okay. Um, well, I want to see that hadith. Yeah, it's in Bukhari Muslim. Of course, it's not going to hadith, Daniel. But then you that's one verse remind me of that you said any Jew and a Christian not innocent. Okay? I'm sure if you that I'm is not. I'm not Muslim, yeah. Yeah, I'm sure you that. According to uh, Ibn Kathir, I'm not innocent. <laughs> Ibn Kathir, he said that, yeah? Yeah, I'll show it to you. <laughs> No, like, it is a joke. What? Uh, do you reject Ibn Kathir now? So if Allah said something and gets Ibn Kathir, what, what, should, what should I do with Daniel? Let's see. Let's no, no, Daniel, be honest. See. If Allah said something and Ibn Kathir said something go and guessed it, as a Muslim, what should we do? I, I'm not your scholar. Yeah, but as, but you know about Islam, that we follow Quran, correct? We follow God. Okay, let's see. Let's see what your, uh, your Quran says. Allah does not forbid, by the way, Surah Mumtahina, okay, this chapter. I don't know all the names so of chapter 60. 60 verse yeah, verse number 8. Okay. Oh, Allah, verse eight. Allah does not forbid you from those who do not fight because of your religion and do not expel you from your homes from being righteous toward them and acting justly toward them. Indeed, Allah loves those who, are, who act justly. Allah only forbids you from those who fight you because of religion and expel you from your homes and aid in your explosion. Uh, forbid you that. Allah forbid you that you make allies of them. And whoever makes allies of them, then it, uh, it is those who are the wrongdoers. So clearly, Daniel, Allah categorized you to two people. That's, there's no Christian and Jew in there. There's anyone. Allah said, whoever, look. Uh, Allah said, Allah forbid you to do justly with those. To anyone, those. And Allah, uh, say, those, anyone. So uh, a Christian, a Jew, fire worshiper, okay? We're not allowed to harm them if they never attack us and this is a clear verse okay okay, okay. so if Ibn Kathir said something against it I don't accept Ibn Kathir because it's not Allah mentioned that clear Ibn Kathir says this yeah? and I said it to you before yeah which I'm gonna get show you that you, uh, you're gonna miss quote now I'll let you miss quote go what on what do you mean miss quote I'll the reference here yeah go on remember show the people that is not Ibn Kathir that is someone sending you something no no it is Ibn Kathir I've got it on my that is not Ibn, I'm gonna get Ibn Kathir Tafsir Ibn Kathir part 2 Surah Al-Baqarah okay which is Surah 2 253 to 286 yeah and then surah al-imran ayat 1 to 92 yeah abridged by sheikh muhammad nasif arifa yeah okay yeah page 37 to 38 yeah you are putting it together these two verses which are separate you put it together to say this verse that uh, uh the, the, reason, class, the did, reason why okay, came there is no compulsion or religion okay who we'll gets it Pause, okay. There's no. You are. If you live in that, like in this country, the government here protecting me. Shamsi. The police are protecting me. Shamsi. If the whole world you. is under Sharia law, yeah. yeah. What are you protecting me from? Me paying you jizya. If the the, the be, whole world is under Sharia, there can't law. be the whole world in Sharia law anyway. This is just a, another play game. Oh, you don't the, want that. The, the, what do you mean? I don't want that. I want you to become think, Muslim. You don't think that would happen? When Jesus come back, yeah. Okay. You see, he's gonna be. I but guess you're not protecting me from it. Ah.
That's why. That's why Islamically, if I'm not protecting you, you're not allowed to give the jizya. Yeah, but jizya is not tax. It's not even uh, in the hand. Anyway, it's a different subject. We'll talk about yeah. And so, I debated Adnan on that. Yeah, yeah. And he must, uh, to be honest, he did well and he explained to you. No. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, the, the verse. Shall I read what it says? Yeah? No, Surat Mumtahina. Let's go to Surat Mumtahina. Ibn Kathir. No, but he, he, he mentioned his verse first. Let him go to his verse first. Ibn Kathir, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Let's go to his verse. Um. So Surat Baqarah, yeah? Ibn Kathir. Uh, volume 2. Part 2. What is the verse? Nobody said Ali Imran. You talk about yeah, uh, Ibn Kathir. Okay. Bakr and Ali Imran. No, no, no. We're going to go to Ibn Kathir Bakr because Ibn Kathir doesn't explain Bakr and Ali Imran at the same time. Okay, so there's some of it together for you. Let's see if you have. Two, 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 I know, I know two five, does, six. Yes. Yeah, some of it together. Yeah, yeah. So huh? we, we, two, five, six, like Yeah, yeah, but the, yeah. the, 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 the. There's no compulsion religion? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so shall I read it, yeah? Yeah, go on. Go on. It's uh, not that read long. It's not that long. Yeah, yeah, I'll read it from Ibn Kathir. Okay. The reason for the revelation of this verse, which is 256, uh, sorry, 256, sorry. Um, the reason for the revelation of this verse was that women of Ansar used to make a vow to convert their sons to Judaism if the latter lived. And when the tribe of Bani Anhider was expelled from Medina, some children of Ansar were among them, so their parents could not abandon them. Hence, Allah revealed there is no compulsion in religion. Narrated Ibn Jarir on the authority of Ibn Abbas, Abu Dawud, An Nasa, and the authority of uh, Banadar, Abu Hatim, Ibn Abamin. Ab you're, you're better than me. Yeah, yeah no problem, no problem. No from the hadith, when it comes to uh, English uh, pronunciation, I'm worse too. And others. However, Muhammad Ibn Ishaq narrated that Ibn Abbas said it was revealed with regard to a man from the tribe of Bani Salim called al Husseini, whose two sons converted to Christianity, but he himself was a Muslim. He told the Prophet, shall I force them to embrace on Islam? They insist on Christianity. Hence, Allah revealed this verse, but this verse is abrogated by the verse of fighting. Mm. You shall be called to fight against the people given to great warfare, then you shall fight them or they shall surrender. Surah 48 ayah 16. Yeah. Allah also says, O Prophet, strive hard against the disbelievers and the munafikins, the hypocrites, and be harsh against them. Surah 973. And he says, O you who believe, fight those of the disbelievers who are close to you and let them find harshness in you and know that Allah is, the, is with those who are pious. Surah 9, 1, 2, 3. And then he finishes off with this. Therefore, all people of the world should be called to Islam. If any of them refuses to do so, or refuses to pay the jizya, they should be fought till they are killed. Okay, so this chapter, also uh, explanations of Bakara, correct? Bakara and Imran, yeah. Okay, no, 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 no. First of all, first as Bakara and Bakara, Imran, yes. Yeah. We'll go to Bakara. Imran? Yeah, I'm, I'm right here, yeah. So, let Ikra and Fiddi. There is no compulsion religion. Ibn Kathir, yeah. Okay. Meaning, do not force anyone to become a Muslim. For Islam is plain and clear. And its proofs and evidence are plain and clear. Therefore, there is no need to force anyone to embrace Islam. Rather, whoever Allah directs Islam, open his heart for it, and enlighten his mind, will embrace Islam with certainty. Whoever Allah blinds his heart and seals his hearings and sight, then he will not benefit from being forced into embrace Islam. So if you look at the clearly say, you can't force someone to become Muslim. Why? Because the condition to become Muslim is heart. You force him will not benefit him. Yeah, that is a clear. Yeah, yeah. What is we'll the go. reason? It was reported that the Ansar were the reason behind revealing this ayah. Although its indication is general in meaning, it's general, not just for the Ansar. Okay. Ibn Jari recalled that Ibn Abbas and said that before Islam, when the Ansar woman would not bear children who would live, she would vow that if she gives a birth to a child uh, who remain alive, she would raise him as a Jew. When Ben Nadir, the Jewish tribe, were advocated. From the Medina, some of the children of Ansar were being raised among them. And the Ansar said, We will not abandon our children. Allah revealed, La ikra fi din, min al There is no compulsion in religion. Verily, the right path has become distinct from the wrong path. Abu Dawood and Nasa'i also recorded this hadith. As for the hadith that Imam Ahmed recorded, in which Anas said, The Messenger of Allah said to a man, Aslim, qala inni kariyan. Qala in kunta kariyan. Okay, he said, Embrace Islam. 
The man said, I dislike it. Prophet said, even if you dislike it, the uh, first, this is an authentic, the uh, first, this is an authentic hadith with only three narrators between Imam Ahmed and Prophet Sallallahu However, it is not relevant to the subject under discussion. For Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu did not force that man to become Muslim. The Prophet merely invited this man to become a Muslim and he replied that does not find himself eager to become Muslim. The Prophet said to the man that even though he dislikes embrace Islam, he should still embrace it for Allah will grant you sincerity and true intent. Okay, so Ibn, Ibn Kathir here doesn't mention anything about abrogation of the verse. The one, okay. I the one I read to you from the beginning, you didn't read it. Yeah, from the beginning, yeah. There's Let no conclusion reason narrated by Ibn Jarir on the authority of Ibn Abbas, all of that. Yeah. Let it come from Dina's verse. And he goes on to say, no compulsion religion. Allah said, there is compulsion. That's it. So is this, where, where is the reference for this? That's Ibn Kathir, yeah. Yeah, no, I know, but where is the reference of... Uh, this was Baqarah. Part 2, Surah Al-Baqarah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 253 to 286. 253 to 86? To 286, that is the reference. Okay, so, first of all... 253, this, this one, 253. Is this, no, this is 256, yeah? Don't you have a number on there? Yeah, there is a number, but here. 200. Uh, so 255. Uh, yeah, 255. So, so this one, 256. So 253 to 286. So, so this one, 256, yeah? Yeah, so Bakra, yeah. So Bakra, 253. Okay. So you, you said there's no compulsion religion. That's the first, yeah? Yeah, it includes that. That's 256, isn't it? So, two, no, there's 256, but you tell me 253. So it starts from there, and it goes to two. It doesn't six. go like that, because after that, it's explained the other verses. That's what I'm saying, Daniel. Someone, yeah, no other verses, yeah. yeah, that's what I'm saying. Someone collect it and put it as one paragraph, which is not one paragraph. I know that. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I put it as one paragraph. Uh, are you put it as one paragraph. Okay, yeah. so 253. Okay. Uh, it's here, volume 1, 253. Yeah. I believe it's uh, yeah, 252. 252. No, it's volume 2, yeah. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's 2, it's 2. Do yeah. you have 286? Go all the way down to 286. Yeah, but we go 252 first. I know, but if you don't have 286. 253. 253 here. Yeah, 253. 253 here. Mm -hmm. um, That's the compulsion, isn't it? No. No, sorry, 256. Yeah, those messengers, we preferred some of them to other. To some of them, Allah spoke directly. No, you don't need to read everything. Yeah, but I'm saying 253, this one is 253. No, 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 I just need to. Yeah, Allah states, so that's explanation of Ibn mm Kathir -hmm. now. Allah honored some prophets above others. Allah stated that He has honored some prophets to others. For instance, Allah said, uh, skip the Arabic bit, okay? Mm -hmm. And indeed, we have preferred some of the prophets above others. And to Dawood, we gave the Zabur, Psalms. In the ayah above, Allah said, Those messengers were preferred, some of them, to others. To some of them, Allah spoke directly. Meaning, Musa and Muhammad وسلم, and also Adam, who called it to Hadith, they called it Isa ibn Hibban from Abu Dhar. Others has raised to degree of honor as it, as uh, is evident in the hadith about the Isra journey when the messenger of Allah saw the prophets in the various heavens okay, of quality. You, you don't need to read this. Yeah, but uh, you say 253, Daniel, it's not here. I, no, 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 but you need to read it all the way up to 286. Yeah, but uh, there's nothing. The, no, the reference, the reference from 253 to 286. Yeah, but there's But the ones I got it from, yeah, is 253. Uh, two two uh, five six. Yeah. Yeah, I was there two five six. Here. I know, but uh, don't say what you said. The one, the one I read was two five six, and also Ali Imran. So you need to but, get the Ali Imran. Okay, we go to Ali Imran. But first of all, two five six. Mm. I read it. Mm. Some of them you mentioned is not there. <laughs> Let me see. Anything. I think it's not. Uh, yeah, two five six. Yeah. 256 There is no compulsion religion mm -hmm. The meaning do not force anyone to become Muslim Which you never read this He said the meaning do not force anyone to become Muslim For Islam is plain and clear And it is proofs and evidence are plain and clear Therefore there is no need to force anyone to embrace Islam Yeah, yeah but that, that's different that's a, that's another Yeah but it's not here It's not here, why is it not here? 
you, you should, that's not the point. The but point, no, the point, point you the should point be. The point was about jizya. That's why I put it here. No, no, no. The point is you are explaining the verse la ikraf din, which you said you took it from Ibn Kathir. What well, you I'm mentioned? We're talking about apostasy. No, no, apostasy. Yeah. We're talking about the verse. Yeah, all forcing people. But that's what Actually, the verse here. Yeah, look, here, yeah. No, it's this one. Here. Yeah, go on. <laughs> you went so far. Oh, sorry. This is it. Here, here two. Five six. Yeah, and this is the quotation. Yeah, so I'll, I'll, I'll put the quotation on there. Yeah, but you're not quoting Ibn Kathir correctly. You just chose some stuff which you think will support your no, claim. No. Daniel, okay, this Ibn Kathir is not me. Le, okay, let's That's read, a book. Let's read Ali Imran. Okay, Ali Imran, no problem. Because it's together with Ali Imran. No, but, but it's not together. First of all, you, I'm saying this is what you did last time. No, I put it together. I understand, but you pick and choose before no, you're going to help you. I didn't pick and choose. You did it. I'm talking about the jizzy. Because you just mentioned it as not. Now we're talking about that we use, remember the main point here is that every Jew and a Christian are enemies, not innocent. That was the claim. Don't go some Jew and a Christian, yeah. Yes, yeah, so I'm saying and I'll show you the verse of Mutahina which refute that. Now you said no Ibn Kathir has something against it. No, Ibn Kathir, Ibn Kathir, Ibn Kathir, sorry, sorry. Ibn Kathir has something against it in terms of jizya. No, no, and no, jizya no, is for the Jews. We're not talking about jizya. We're talking about if you remember it's recorded. Yeah, but Jews and Christians are in uh, 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 No, no, before. No one else pays Jesus. No, no, uh, the, 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 the pagans pay Jesus as well. Which pagan? The, uh, the, the fire worshippers. They take the ruling to pay Jesus. Jesus. Because the narration that Ibn Qayyim mentioned about it, some scholars mentioned that. But that's a different subject, to be honest. Exactly, Daniel. that's different. Yeah, so. so I'm no, no, about but no, no. Daniel, I quote you the verse. You said to me, in every Christian or Jew is the enemy of Islam. I got the verse from a mutahina to show you, you that show Allah. Surah 60 verse yeah, to show you Allah categorized you to two people. Okay, but people who are enemies of Islam try to harm us and fight against us, and those who does not fight against us and does not harm us, Allah said, deal justly and kindly with them, because Allah loves those who are kindly and justly. Which is you went, you went on to say, him yet, You went on to say, Ibn Kathir has something against it. So far, we read Ibn Kathir concerning Surah Baqarah. Doesn't not say nothing against it. Now we go Ali Amara, no problem. Okay. No, no problem. Just for, for everyone to understand, and, and then, we're going step then, by are step. You say, are you saying that's a contradiction of Surah 98 verse? There is no contradiction at all. Surah 98 verse. No this verse is what Ali Amara no, talking the about one the fighters. You read, the one you read, 60 verse 8. Contradicts what? Those people, if they don't fight you, they're peaceful. Yeah? Yeah. So is that contradicting when the Muslims and I'm sorry, Jews and Christians are the worst of creatures in Surah 98? That, if you read TFC, that's talking about in the hellfire, in the hereafter. No, yeah. Even on the Quran, it says it. Yeah, I mean, in the here, uh, in but the here after. But it says they it's, are uh, the worst of creatures. Mean in the here after, in the place of Jahannam. No, it's not. Yeah, okay, I'll show we'll, you. We'll I'll that. show you, no we'll problem. That, we'll, let's read that, Alimran. Daniel, if you speak to me like the way we're speaking, I have nothing to hide. I can break down every doubt you bring. But when I shout to people, speakers, I don't like it, I got frustrated as well. You know, we have a nice conversation. I'm not going to tell you you're going to become Muslim, become Christian, but at the end, where we live, we live with peace, thinking about it, with respect. But I don't just shout and going crazy. So what is the verse, uh, Daniel? Yeah, Ali Imran? Uh, yeah. 1 to 92, which is long, but let's see. 1? 1? 192, yeah? 1 up to 92. Uh, so from the beginning? Yeah. Ali Imran, yeah? Yeah. Ali Imran is 3. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What is your channel? Our channel is Dusuna. Dusuna. Du du yeah, I will give you right down for you. Yeah. yeah. So, okay, Allah, yeah. Surah yeah, Imran was revealed in Medina as evident by the fact that the first A3 ayat in it relate to the delegation from Najran that arrives in Medina on the ninth year Hijri. We will elaborate on this subject. When we explain the ayah about the Mubahala, okay, in this surah, Allah will. So, this verse. In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. Alif Lam Mim. Allah, none has the right to be worshipped but He. Ever living, the one who sustains and protects all that exists. It is who has sent down the book to you with the truth, confirming what comes before it. And He sent down the Torah and the Injil. A four, a four time as a guidance to mankind and he sent down the criteria truly those who disbelieve in the ayah of the ayat of Allah for them there is a severe torment and Allah is almighty 
all able of retribution. Retribution. We mentioned the hadith in the tafsir of the ayat kursi. That mentioned Allah the greatest name is contained in these two ayah. Okay, this 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 two twenty two two fifty five. That's talking about the first in Surah Al-Baqarah. He is going to talk about what is the greatest name of Allah. Is it Allah or yeah, Allah? You find, you find it in here. Everything that I read, you find it. Brother, this is Ibn Kathir. I mean, Daniel, this is Ibn Kathir. Yeah, I know. I know it's Ibn Kathir. That's, so that's a book. This is not book. This is you putting something. I got it from here. So show I, us. You haven't, okay. I mean, you haven't even finished reading it. Yeah, read it. We are waiting for you. Then you have to sorry for you, man. Can become Muslim. They put a big trouble on you. Yeah, <laughs> they, put, they tell you something, look at this, even here. I am good. And you are claiming something, I guess, if look at this. I am saved in Jesus. He's you not know, saved. Jesus couldn't even save himself according to you. How is he going to save you? He saved himself. How? He killed him. He doesn't need to save himself. Yeah, but so he, why are you begging for his father to save him? Because that was his humanity. To save himself, correct? Yeah. So but he didn't. So he, 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 he resurrected himself. No, he didn't. According he didn't. to the Bible, the Father resurrected him. No. Yeah. The Bible says that I would take my life and resurrect myself. So he committed suicide then? No, he didn't commit suicide. Because he took his life? No, he didn't commit suicide. If you, uh, if you kill yourself, you don't commit suicide? But he didn't kill himself. But so he so took his life? The Romans, the Romans killed him. So, so he never took his life then? The Romans took his life? Yeah, willingly he died. That's no, but he said, Father, help me. Why ask for help if you don't need me? Yeah, because that's when you feel on your in your flesh. But you said willingly. Really, really. You said willingly. Really. Yeah, he was willing at the end. He was so why why was asking for help then? Because he felt it on the flesh. So it was the, willingly. The disconnection between him and the father. <laughs> right, alhamdulillah for Islam. Daniel, stop joking around. One right is a serious matter. It is a serious matter. One right must that's stand before repent. God. That's why you need to repent. One right. Doesn't make any sense. You, I, I never see Christian preaching Christianity except he contradicts himself every two minutes. Yeah, because Jesus, the, the Father is Jesus, Son of God, but is God. So he's the Son of himself, or he's the Son of someone else. Is it the Father, or is it the Son? Or is it God, or the Son of God? Son of God is a divine term. Yeah, so, but, uh, but uh, uh, he's the Son of himself then? No, he's not. So he's not God then? He's Jesus. God. So is he Son of God, Jesus? There's one God, three persons. So Jesus is Son of God or not? Jesus is the Son of God. Is Jesus God? Yeah. So he's Son of himself? All right, take it. I've done a joke. You know, my family couldn't actually have to do the shopping. So come, we'll get us there. What you were reading? Yeah, but this is going to take longer than... It's not here. I don't lie, it's not. This is why I can't... I, I don't it. think someone put... You know, it was That's not you. That's why I can It was not you. I remember. Okay, someone said it to you in email. I remember I yet... Said, I sent myself things nah. in my own email. How come you are putting Ibn Kathir and we went to the actual verse and Ibn Kathir never said what you just said? He didn't say it, trust me. And you left what Ibn Kathir clearly said, you're not allowed to force no one to become Muslim. No, I didn't leave that. that so, can you point. show me? Can you read that it? wasn't the point here. Why? Because why? You said you have to, you can force people. Are you saying that you can't force people. You can't force people. I was just already Allah first and he what he said. Clearly. So where is he so right now? Daniel, you're going to finish whole book and we're going to stay here for night? I'm on 77. Right. So, 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 wait, wait, before we go. So from 177, there's nothing about what no, you're supposed So can you uh, quote? Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, but you, you left over 77 verses and where is the, the point of evidence here? I'm going to show you, wait. Wait, I'm not here. Maybe not today. Okay. Because it just came up. Yeah, but you have it here. I condense it, yeah. To make it easy, you see. How long is it? Because when you're going like this, you're looking like this. An hour. Yeah, uh, I think we have to stop here, man, and then next time, inshallah, I have no problem. An hour. Yes. Yeah, yeah roughly. I've been roughly. here an hour. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah and I have to go as well. Have you read it? Not all of it. Not all of it.
covered with. You haven't read the palm ten. The pa? I read the pa. The palm ten. Yeah, I read it, but you don't know where is it. But I'm gonna show the people that you are just a hatibulay. You are a nighttime collector. You know what it means? You go on dark night and you collect anything. It was actually in the, in the day. Sir. No, it was not because the fact that you are claiming is in the cafe and we're giving you a book. We're not forcing you nothing, and you're not, you are it. struggling. No, I'm not struggling. Yes. It just takes time to find it. Yes, it takes time. That's but you said is. it's from 1 to 94. So you have to have some passages there already speaking about it. Mm. But from 1 to 70, there is no verse speaking about the issue we spoke about. That every Christian and Jew are our enemies. It's not a problem, man. If I can't find it today, I'll find it for you. No, but uh, Daniel, already you've been exposed. I yes, Daniel, you said upon your phone, based upon your phone, I mean, the verse from 1 to 94, Ali Imran. So, therefore, from 1 to 94, is speaking about the subject that you are going to mention to us. However, you've been reading from 1 to 70. I haven't verses. read from 1 to 70. You I, are, I just saw the numbers. Yeah, but you are, so there's no verse speaking about the subject. So, it's not from 1 to 94, maybe from 94 to after. No, 1 to 92. So, where is it? Bro, it would take long to find it. Bro, it's, you it's, already passed one. And, and the verse one doesn't speak about it. Verse two doesn't speak about no, it. No, the abrogation. The abrogation yeah, is, not, is not like 1 to 92. The abrogate, you know, 1 to 92 is an explanation of what Ibn Kathir is saying. But the ones that I've quoted, like this verse has been abrogated. It's help. not 1 to 92. No, it's not. I will help you. Look. You're talking you're about. Saying it's not there. No, it's is that what no, you're saying? no. What I'm saying, Daniel. What I read is not there. Is that what you're what saying? What are you doing? You're mixed. You're mixed and you're making claims. Nash, I, I help you. Daniel, Daniel, because I'm not quoting it. I want you there. to show you that Ibn Kathir never said as him saying it. You're talking about the verse when Allah said, fight against those who does not believe in Allah on the last day from among the Jews and the Christians. Okay? Until they pages Jizya. Okay? This verse. Yes, some scholars mentioned that this verse abrogated not the verse of Mumtahina, the verse that Ikraf did. No, it abrogated Surah 2. No, 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 not Mumtahina. No, no, but not Mumtahina, which I mentioned as a proof. Mumtahina 60, something. Okay, I'm not talking about 60. Yeah, but I'm, I'm talking about 2. No, but Dan, you remember our main point. Our main point, you said every Christian and a Jew is not innocent. What? I'm sure what, you. Okay, what 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 I'm the 60. Is 60. it Medina or Mecca? Medina. 60. Yeah, 60 is Medina. Yes, yeah, so in Medina. Okay, so yeah. are you saying that's not abrogated? No, it's not. Because if it was Mecca, you're going to say it's abrogated. Say it here has been abrogated no, no. by the fighting verses. That's what I'm saying. You are misquoting Ibn Kathir. Should I help you to go to the verse? I didn't misquote me. Because that's it. Ibn Kathir brings to abrogated, not Sultan of Tahina. Abrogate the verse. There is no compulsion religion. However, many scholars of the past, our